Hello, Melbourne. Uh, my name is Jason, and I'm an atheist, but I have a lot of friends who are Christians, unfortunately. Uh, one of my best friends is Christian. He has a house party every year, and last year I was at a house party. And at the party, my Christian friends started talking about religion, which is fine. Then he starts talking about the Bible, which is fine. Then he starts saying stuff like, you know, according to the Bible, the earth is 5,000 years old. And immediately I'm like, uh, bro, according to the facts, he cut me off. I don't care about your facts. God told us through the Bible, the earth is 5,000 years old, and that is good enough for me. And Jason, it's very disrespectful of you to come to my house and to tell me otherwise. So things got a little bit tense and awkward, like how it's now. <laughs> so, for the sake of our friendship, I just let it go, right? Friendship more important than being right. So I just, I just, just let it go, right? His house, his party, it's fine. The problem is, I tend to hold on to grudges for a very long time. <laughs> that is very Christian of me. <laughs> so, I wanted to get my revenge, okay? And this is how I got my revenge. My friend has a seven-year-old son. And, uh, no, no, fuck you, not like that. Relax. <laughs> I, I'm not that Christian, so just... just okay, just... Yeah, but, okay. Okay. So, okay, just relax, okay. <laughs> this is how I got my revenge, okay? So, uh, every year, I buy the son uh, a Christmas present, right? And uh, for, so, for last year's Christmas present, I bought the son uh, a very big children's book about dinosaurs. You see, the people who laugh just now, these people read. <laughs> so, for those of you who didn't laugh, fuck, let me explain, okay? So, <laughs> you see, my friends, every children's book about dinosaurs will have that one line. Dinosaurs went extinct 65 million years ago. <laughs> and my fantasy is I want my friend to read the book to his son. All right, dinosaurs, okay, like this, okay. Uh, dinosaurs went extinct, ah, fuck. <laughs> Who gave you this book? <laughs> no, Uncle Jason, okay, fuck that guy. <laughs> and I've always wondered, what if, when he reads the book to his son, he tries to reconcile these two things? The earth being 5,000 years old, and the existence of dinosaurs. He reads the book to his son. Uh, dinosaurs went extinct 65 million years ago, and uh, before that, Jesus rode on a triceratops to battle. <laughs> and Moses crossed the Red Sea, hanging on to the pterodactyls. <laughs> so that is a true story. And uh, I was telling this story on stage at, at a bunch of shows back in Malaysia last year. And in one of the shows, my Christian friend showed up. <laughs> so after the show, he confronted me. He said, Jason, I want to talk to you about your joke. By the way, I know you're talking about me. I have a bone to pick with you. Why do you say at the end, Jesus rode on the triceratops to battle? I said, because it's, it's funny to me, right? And he goes, yeah, but in the Bible, Jesus was never involved in any battles. <laughs> and he goes, yeah, Jason, those are the facts. And I'm like, I don't care about your facts. Jesus riding on a triceratops to battle, that is funny to me and that is good enough for me. <laughs> and it's very disrespectful of you <laughs> to come to my show <laughs> and to tell me otherwise. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Melbourne, you guys are always great. Thank you. I'll see you at the show. Thank you. Good night. Thank you.